welcome back. I'm so glad you guys are still with me on this journey. This is awesome. I'm so happy that you guys are all here. So today's practice is about self-trust. If anything has ever thrown you off of that self-trust, it can be really detrimental. Um, so I know personally for me, um, I always had had insights and would have flashes of things kind of come to my mind about things, but I was dealing with somebody in my life who was not being honest. And so that really caused me to start doubting these things that I was feeling, these things that I was um, seeing and knowing, and it really caused a lot of spiritual damage in my life. So once the truth finally came out, as unpleasant as it was, it immediately created this shift within me that made me realize like, hey, I've known all along and that I really need to trust myself so much more. So that is what we are working on here today. You have all the answers to everything that you need to know. It's in your heart. It's in divine mind. Um, and let me tell you something else here. So when we think about divine mind, when we think about your mind, I know very often the idea of mind and our brain, our head comes together, but I believe divine mind actually comes from the center of us. It's from the center of our being. And when we really tune into that uh, in combination with our heart, then we get clarity that comes through. So today, as we work on this self-trust, what we're going to do is uh, find physically in our body where we carry this knowing, this trust that we have inside of ourselves. We're going to work to expand and grow it so that you can follow that intuition that is here to guide you. It is your gift that you have is to have this intuition. So as we increase that self-trust, um, our life just becomes better. As we get more clarity, we know the direction that we need to move. We begin to find things that um, just bring us joy and excitement. And also it, it keeps us in alignment with divine mind, with the divine, which is love. So have you ever uh, had, let's say, just a thought kind of come to you and maybe it was some very random thing like, oh, I need to go and talk to this person or, oh, I should go and do this. And then you didn't follow it. You know, those things come up and now I listen to those things. Um, I had a couple instances of something that happened that really proved to me that I needed to listen to that inner intuition. So one time I'm at my sister-in-law's house, I'm leaving, packing up, getting ready to leave, go to the house, lock the house. And I kept hearing, check for your cell phone, check for your cell phone. And I was talking myself out of it because I was like, no, I know that I put it in my purse. I remember doing it. I know I had it and just kept hearing, check for your cell phone. And I said, no. So anyways, I locked myself out of the house, um, get to the car, go to make a phone call and I couldn't make that phone call because I didn't have my phone. I had locked it in the house. So this became quite the hassle as I had already dropped the house key in the mailbox, which is a locking mailbox and I couldn't get it back. So this was like a couple hours of a total screw around where had, had I just listened to that inner voice and that knowing that said, go check for your cell phone, I would not have been in that predicament, but I'm so glad that that happened because now I do listen to that. And if I have this inkling, um, I need to go and talk to that stranger over there and tell them, you know, whatever thing, I'm gonna go and do that. And good, whether I'm aware of it at the time or not, will always come from it. I just trust that good will always come from it when we listen to that divine guidance, that inner trust that is there. So if you are someone that really doubts yourself, we are going to work on releasing that doubt here today and building up that trust so that you feel 
and are in alignment with that divine mind so that your life just becomes wonderful and that the creations that you begin creating are also just wonderful and in alignment with who you really are, which will just bring you so much happiness and joy. You know, if you have ever just known something, you just knew that you knew, that is what we are talking about, working on growing that so that you can benefit, you can use it in your life, and you can use it to also help other people and the world. So if you guys are ready today, let's get ready for today's session. So as we begin today's session on um, self-trust, we are going to find this trust inside of our body, work to build it up and to expand it so that we can follow it so much more often. So get nice and comfortable here and just begin by very calmly closing your eyes and focusing on your breathing. So today, in today's exercise, as we begin here, we are going to bring a deep level of relaxation and calm inside of our body. So with your eyes closed there, we are going to just start by putting all of our tension and our tightness and our stress inside of the palms of our hands. And so as we do that, we are going to make a fist here with our hands. So I want you to make that fist nice and tight. If you happen to have sharp nails, um, you'll figure it out there. Just closing your eyes um, and making that nice tight fist there with your hands. So I am going to count up from five to one and I want you to squeeze tighter and tighter and tighter, not hurting yourself, but squeeze tighter and tighter with every number that goes by. Ready? So one, two, tighter and tighter, three, four, even tighter, five. Now open your hands and let them completely relax. Relax your fingers, let them expand and loosen and really relax there. Excellent. So we're going to do that again here. So just making that fist again there with your hands, making it nice and tight as I count from one to five, squeezing tighter and tighter. So one, even tighter, two, even more, three, stronger, four, stronger, five, even stronger. Now open your hands and let them fully relax. Open your hands and let them fully relax. Excellent. And we are going to do that one more time here. And as we do that this time, I also want you to flex your feet. So you're going to create tightness there in your feet as if you were making a fist, but with your feet. Ready? So just making that fist there again with your hands. Squeezing those feet nice and tight. One, tighter, two, tighter, three four and five and open your fingers, relax your feet and really just relax here. Wonderful. So I want you to just notice the sensations that you now have in the palms of your hands and in your feet. Your hands may at this point feel very tired they might feel very loose and heavy and relaxed. And so as we follow this feeling of heavy comfort and relaxation that is there, we're just going to build up a feeling of deep inner calm now. So I want you to just imagine with every breath that you breathe in that this beautiful calm colored light fills your lungs all the way up and as you exhale also just exhaling calm so imagine this light is all around your body and you can just breathe it in and breathe it out and so just continuing to breathe there and just breathing in the word calm. So thinking about that calm, 
word every time you breathe. And now I want you to imagine that you have a workshop, so some type of room that you can do some kind of work, some crafts um, in that room. And we are going to fill that entire room with signs, um, perhaps blankets or pictures or whatever kind of crafts want to come to mind there and every item that is in that workshop from the uh, stuffed teddy bear over in the corner to those curtains have the word calm written on them and so perhaps you could even imagine yourself in that workshop working on a new project maybe you're painting maybe you're sewing uh, the word calm into whatever it is that you happen to be working on so just noticing all the different items all the different things there in your workshop that have that beautiful word calm written on them And so now you may even notice that over in the corner of that workshop, because you must spend a lot of time there, there is a bed that looks very comfortable with those calm blankets and that calm pillow on it. And you are just going to go over there. Um, you know, maybe there's more than one pillow. There certainly would be on my calm bed. But as you go and you make your way over there onto that bed, just getting nice and comfortable and sinking so deep there into those calm blankets, into the calm pillows, and into that really comfortable calm mattress that is there. wonderful so you become so calm and so relaxed when you are laying there in that bed that you actually just begin to drift down sinking so deep inside of that bed that you begin to dream and as you begin to just drift off and dream you dream that you are on a beach in the most relaxing hammock that is just swaying so gently oh, from side to side back and forth so comfortably and the temperature there on that beach is just absolutely wonderful it's perfect the most relaxing and beautiful day and as you sway there in this hammock you begin to remember that you can trust yourself so deeply and as you begin to remember this I want you to think about a time in your life when that feeling of trust was present and now if you cannot think of a time when this trust was present um, please stop this video and go to the womb or back to a past life regression session um, but as you bring up this feeling of trust you also could even just imagine somebody who really would trust themselves and what that might feel there so as you just remember this we're going to build this feeling of trust of inner trust up inside of our body 
So I am going to count from one to four. And as that feeling of trust is now there, it should be there, um, we are going to build that feeling up a little bit more with every number that goes by. Ready? So one, I want you to double that feeling of trust. Just make it stronger. Two, build it up. Make that feeling more powerful, even better. Three, build it up more powerful, more strength. Oh, wonderful. Four, build it up even stronger. Excellent. So now as you have this feeling of trust here, this beautiful feeling of inner trust, I want you to locate it. I want you to notice physically in your body where you feel that feeling of trust. So do that now. Locate where it is. Maybe it's several places. Maybe it's just one. Just become aware of the place inside of you where that trust is stored. Wonderful. And so as you have this feeling there and you know where it's coming from. Now I want you to shrink yourself up super tiny so that you can jump inside of the space and see what message or messages are there for you from this feeling of trust. So just do that now. Shrink yourself up, jump inside of that space and just listen and wait to see what messages you can even ask what messages do you have here for me please tell me and just see what comes through wonderful so if you got a message there just remembering what it is and so now as we are still um, in that space there we are just going to apologize to this part of us so you can just follow my lead here so trust I am so sorry that I don't always trust you please forgive me Thank you. I love you. Trust, I am sorry that I have allowed other things to come in and to make my judgments. And I have doubted you. And I am so sorry for this. Please forgive me. Trust. I forgot what it felt like. I forgot what it was like to be in tune with you for a while. And I'm so sorry. Please forgive me. Thank you. I love you. Trust. I promise to follow you. I promise to listen to you and to take action when you ask me to. Thank you for being here for me. And as we feel this feeling of trust here inside of us, let's just work to expand that up and out in every direction. So I'm going to count from one to three. Let's expand this trust up and out in every direction. So one, expand it up, expand it out, all directions. Two, expand it, increase that feeling of trust inside of you, build it up stronger, more powerful. Three, build it up even more. Excellent. Excellent. Wonderful. So now I want you to just imagine a situation where you need this trust and I want you to see it is there for you. Do that now.
Okay, and now imagine the next situation where you need this trust and I want you to see it's there for you now. So go ahead and check. Go and see that it's there. And one more time, one more situation where you feel that you could use this trust. I want you to see that it is there for you. And as it is there, send out a feeling of joyful gratitude to it up and out in all directions. And now if there were any situations here that destroyed that trust that you have in yourself, let's just work to remove those here now. So imagine that you have your bare feet down on the ground. Now this feeling of not trusting yourself is a certain color. So whatever color it is that comes to mind, that's correct. Perfect. Okay. And so whatever location that energy was there in your body, just locating the location of not having that trust there um, in your body. Okay, and so now we are just going to use our breath to remove this. So whatever color that is that is there, we are going to send it down our legs out the bottom of our feet. We're going to ground this color there, um, this lack of trust in the earth. So just go ahead and do that now. So just breathing, sending that color down out your feet putting it in the earth, grounding it. Wonderful. And so as this energy there is grounded into the earth, now just imagine the most brilliant, beautiful, divine white light coming in through the crown of your head right at the very top of your skull. And as it comes in through the top of your head, this brilliant white light just gets more and more brilliant, more and more vibrant, more and more loving and kind, and just allow it there to melt through your entire energy system, right from your head all the way down to your feet. And as it moves in, this warm, loving energy nourishes and protects your body. It keeps you safe and comfortable. It allows for exponential growth. creates transformation within the cells of your body and it just wraps you in that beautiful warm loving kindness cleansing away anything and everything known and unknown that you no longer need to carry with you released and free from it now Wonderful. And so as you have this nourishing energy just flowing through your body, if there is somewhere physically 
inside of you that could use this nourishment, just directing that light to that place or those places inside of you, doing that right now. As you do this, allowing that light, that love, that brilliant divine consciousness to go to those places and create optimal health and healing, regeneration of the cells of the body. wonderful <clears throat> wonderful and so with this beautiful divine love moving through your energy system there just sit in that beautiful feeling of calm and inner trust inside of you of just knowing that you know you know what is best for you and really just trusting that and so as I begin to count back here from five to one, we will bring our awareness all the way back into the room. And as we come back, just feeling that good feeling of trust, remembering where we feel that in our body, listening to it, following it, following its guidance. Excellent. And so five, bringing balance and harmony back into our body this um, beautiful feeling, this equilibrium, everything functionally functioning um, exactly as it should, perfect optimal health for gaining insights into ourselves all the time and just being thankful for these insights. Three, just gaining back some energy now inside of your body. You can even imagine breathing energy there inside of your body that wakes up and motivates your cells to um, get moving. Two, as you just allow your breath to bring life back inside of your body, um, stretching out, wiggling those fingers and toes, bringing that awareness back inside of you. And one, all the way back, bringing that awareness into the room that you are in here. Excellent. Really good job here today. Thank you so much for joining me. Um, remember to like and subscribe to these videos, turn on your notifications so that you can know when the next video is coming up. If you enjoyed today's session, please like and share it with some friends, families, co-workers, strangers on the street, whatever feels right. And I hope you guys have the most wonderful day. Thank you so much for joining me here and I will see you all next time. So as we begin today's session on um, self-trust, we are going to find this trust inside of our body, work to build it up and to expand it so that we can follow it so much more often. So get nice and comfortable here and just begin by very calmly closing your eyes and focusing on your breathing. So today in today's exercise, as we begin here, we are going to bring a deep level of relaxation and calm inside of our body. So with your eyes closed there, we are going to just start by putting